So in today's video, we are doing a one month review on my Ethereum mining rig. I will answer some of the most important questions like how much money has it made me, how much electricity did I waste. I will literally show you my electrical bill so you can see all the information. I know a lot of people are interested in mining, so I want to share my personal experience from a first time miner that has never mined before. As you guys know, just over a month ago, I ended up spending $4,500 on this Ethereum mining rig. And I want to give you guys all the latest information, my honest opinions on it, showing you is it profitable, do I regret it, do I plan to keep on mining, and a ton of other questions. But before we get started, I would appreciate it if you smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. Also check out the links in the description box below. And if you have any questions whatsoever, drop them in the comment section as well. And now let's go back to the studio so we can continue this video. Let's go. So before we get any further, I want to make a couple of things clear. This is my first mining rig ever. I am definitely not an expert when it comes to mining Ethereum. So I am not very technical. I'm just a regular guy that wanted to mine Ethereum and wanted to have his own mining rig. So how did I purchase this rig? How much did it cost? And where did I buy it? So just over a month ago, I was on the Facebook marketplace scrolling down to see if I can find a good deal and I came across this mining rig. Initially it was priced at $5,000 but after slight negotiations I was able to get it for $4,500. It is definitely a used rig, it wasn't brand new, the guy was using it to mine Ethereum before I purchased it from him. So I ended up spending $4,500 on the rig. That same day I got it home, pretty much set everything up and it was ready to start mining. At that time the price of Ethereum was over $4,000 and I started mining. There was days where I was making between $50 and $100 mining Ethereum with my mining rig and I was like, this is absolutely amazing, it is going to pay for itself in a couple of months. But recently we have seen the price of Ethereum have a pullback. And as I make this video, one Ethereum is priced at $2,250. Hopefully it goes back up. But being completely honest, the profits that I was making when Ethereum was over $4,000 were absolutely amazing compared to the profits that I'm making right now. Now let me show you the chart so you can see exactly how much I made on week one, week two, week three, and this week, week four. All right, so the first week of mining Ethereum, I made $569 worth of Ethereum, which in my opinion is absolutely awesome. This is more than some people make at a regular nine to five job. And that week, I was super excited. I'm like, yo, I'm gonna buy me like 20 more mining rigs and I'm gonna just start making money mining Ethereum. Second week, we had a pullback. Ethereum started falling big time. And on week two, I only made $256. Week three, the price continued to fall down even further and I only made $198. And then week four, this week, I only made $127. So as you can see, as the price of Ethereum falls, my rig makes less and less money. So that brings my total price to $1,150 worth of Ethereum mined in one month, which is pretty good. But one thing to keep in mind is that is how much money I would have made if I sold my Ethereum. If you end up keeping your Ethereum and you do not sell it every week, then the price will fluctuate depending on what Ethereum does. Personally, I have not sold any of the Ethereum that I have mined so far and I do not plan on selling anytime soon. My plan is to accumulate as much of it as I possibly can. But there's definitely some pros and cons to this method. Let's say you do not sell any of the Ethereum that you mine and you have mined $1,000 worth of Ethereum so far and then the price of Ethereum over the next month doubles. Now your $1,000 will double as well because Ethereum will be worth more. So the longer you hold, the more money you can potentially make. But this is also true the other way around. 
let's say you mine a thousand dollars worth of Ethereum and the price of Ethereum goes from two thousand to one thousand dollars. Now the one thousand dollars of Ethereum that you have is now only worth five hundred dollars. So you have to decide what you plan on doing with the Ethereum that you are mining. Personally, I am holding all the way. And now let's talk about how much electricity I have wasted so far this month. And being 100% transparent, here's my electric bill as promised. As you can see, it is just over $206. And now I will show you the difference in electricity usage this month compared to the same month last year. So for June 2021, I have wasted 1,604 kilowatt hours worth of electricity. Most of it is mining. And now let's compare it to June 2020, where I only wasted 590 kilowatt hours worth of electricity. So as you can see, my electricity usage has doubled. Normally my electric bill for the summer months is between 120 and 140 dollars just depends on the month but now that i'm mining ethereum i believe my electric bill is going to stay around 200 dollars but i will definitely keep you guys posted in future videos also i want to mention that i will be changing my plan going forward as of right now all of the ethereum that i have mined so far has been simply sitting on my exodus wallet doing absolutely nothing from now on, I will take my Ethereum and I will transfer it over to BlockFi so I can earn even more Ethereum. So if you haven't heard about BlockFi, it is an amazing platform that allows you to earn interest on your crypto. You simply create an account, deposit your crypto, and then every single day you will accrue interest, which in my opinion is absolutely amazing. So now we are inside of my BlockFi account and as you can see, I have over $14,858 in my account. Most of it is in USDC and I am accruing interest every single day. So far this month, I have earned $63.45 and $349 so far with my account. I'm having all my interest paid out in Bitcoin so I can accumulate as much of it as I possibly can. So right now I'm only holding Bitcoin and USDC, but I will be depositing my Ethereum so I can accumulate even more of it. This way I'll be earning Ethereum two ways, my mining rig mining Ethereum every day and then BlockFi paying me interest in Ethereum every single day. In my opinion, it is a win-win situation. Also, if you use the BlockFi link in the description box below, you can get up to $250 worth of free Bitcoin. So make sure you check it out. And now let's answer some questions about my mining rig, like how many mega hashes I'm getting, what kind of graphic cards I'm using, and all of that important information. All right, so now we are inside of a Hive OS. This is pretty much the platform that I'm using to mine Ethereum. And as I make this video, I'm getting 257.9 mega hashes with my mining rig. And when we click on the workers, you'll be able to see the temperatures of all the graphic cards that I'm using and some other information. All right, so now we are going to click on cards. And right here, you'll be able to see all the graphic cards that I'm using in my rig. So if you want to pause the video, feel free. That way you'll be able to get all of the information with these cards and how they are tuned in order to perform better. And right here, you can see all the mega hashes that they are getting. Also on top right here, you'll be able to see the electricity consumption. As of right now, it is consuming 636 watts. And now for the most important question, is it worth it? Is it worth it mining Ethereum? And do I plan on continuing to mine? As of right now, one month in, I believe it is absolutely worth it. And I will definitely continue to mine Ethereum going forward, as long as it is possible. So as of right now, if I average $1,000 every single month, and my electric is an extra $60, $70, then I am still in the profit. But who knows where the price of Ethereum is going to be in the future. If it drops down to $500, $400, then I will have to reevaluate my strategy. But as of right now, all the Ethereum that I'm mining, I'm going to put it to BlockFi to earn me even more Ethereum. 
Also, one other thing that I would like to mention, so far I am super impressed, simply because it is so hands off. Since I have plugged up my machine, I have literally ignored it. I do not check it daily. I do not have to do absolutely anything. And it just continues to mine 24 seven, making me money. It is super passive. You do not have to be very technical to do it. In my opinion, it is an awesome way to earn some passive income. So far, it has been completely hands off and I absolutely love it. I can do whatever I want. I can go wherever I want and my mining rig will continue to make me even more money. All right, everybody, that concludes this quick little video. If you have any questions whatsoever, do not hesitate to drop them in the comment section below, and I will do my best to answer all those questions and help you out as much as I possibly can. And as always, smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, check out the links in the description box below, and see you in the next video. Peace out.